So we have a lot of different technology projects that we look at, and one of those is looking at how we control depth of cut. Depth of cut meaning how we engage the formation at a very constant rate. And so that's really where that began. We wanted to make sure we were controlling depth of cut without taking energy away from the cutting structure. The biggest benefit is performance. You know, how do we get all of the energy that we're putting into the bid and put it into the cutting structure? If we can do that, we're gonna drill longer, we're gonna drill faster. The two biggest technologies are the PDC element itself. How do we make sure that we keep the wear on the cutter? How do we make sure that we keep the breakage from the cutter so that we can keep it rolling? And then the other one, which is the biggest one, is how do we retain that element? We want to make sure that it's not breaking. We want to make sure that it's not coming out down holes so that we can keep the depth of cut control constant. Dachi is our mainstay process. It's how we work with our customers. You know, it starts out with us interacting with the customer to find out really what their goal is. If we can understand that goal, then we can come up with a solution. We can analyze what bit we want to use, how we want to use it, what parameters, and then we have to then go and execute. So if we can execute and use those parameters that we've come through a solution on, then we can be successful. We recently had one in North Dakota that we used the cruiser for a directional well when we were drilling the curve. And we drilled the well in under 14 hours, which was the fastest we had ever drilled a curve in that field. So it was a huge success uh, when it came down to trying to use Cruiser uh, in tool phase control application.